for many decades now, oncology research has uh, relied quite heavily on cell lines to perform preclinical studies. And many of these cell lines are now decades old. And so there's great interest in developing primary uh, cell models from patients, um, not only because we have more detailed clinical history, that these can be personalized to the, to the patient, um, but are also more likely to be representative of the patient tumors, um, and therefore a sort of a more reliable model uh, for our, our preclinical research. Um, Patient-derived xenograft models have an additional advantage over um, cell lines or organoids uh, in that they also offer an in vivo environment. Uh, now, obviously, being injected into immunocompromised mice, it's not a perfect in vivo environment, um, but aspects of the, the tumor microenvironment are present in the, um, in, in the xenograft tumors that currently can't really be recapitulated in in vitro cultures. 